Hello, my name is Randy Rolf, and this is a wonderful event that we're having all over North America and Europe and uh, the other Americas, and it's an active wellness world tour. And we're demonstrating Nikon products and sharing with you about the all the opportunities Nikon has for life balance as well as wellness. And it's an amazing program and uh, we hope you'll enjoy it. We have people on remote on our Zoom, so that's up on our screen, and we have some guests here, and they're still coming in because we're having uh, quite a rainstorm out there, but uh, they will filter in, I'm hoping. So um, I'll get started just by telling my story, and uh, I discovered Niken 19 years ago, almost 20 years ago, and I'd been a nutrition teacher for over 35 years, and uh, since I was 21, got married, decided to learn about nutrition to keep myself and my husband healthy, and uh, I realized there was a lot of controversy, and I did a lot of research, and decided, decided a diet that I wanted us to do, and then when our kids were born, they were very healthy, and we stayed very healthy, um, but we were always looking for other aspects that would help support our health, because our goal is to be married 100 years. We're at 47 years now, and uh, so we, uh, we got a lot of exercise, we walked outdoors, and, uh, and when we were both young lawyers in Philadelphia, we decided that that lifestyle just didn't give us the kind of focus we wanted to have when we had children, and when we were going to uh, build a home. So the commuting and the atmosphere of legal practice was getting more and more adversarial. So we decided to buy an old farmhouse in upstate New York, and uh, as a result of that, we learned an awful lot. And one of the things we learned about was what electromagnetic pollution was doing because uh, we met Indians up there and they were busy uh, with the local farmers trying to combat the, the placing of a high voltage transmission line right across their land. And of course the argument was there was nobody there, but it was farmers and Indians. So when they, uh, we helped them as young lawyers, we were much happier donating our time to do something meaningful than just working for corporations in Philadelphia. And uh, so we learned, we heard all the, the testimony about what electricity and especially these electromagnetic high voltage lines were doing. Um, more cancer, the, the closer you were to the lines, the farmers were noticing real problems with their dairy cows, they'd, ha they'd have stillbirths or two-headed calves. Um, and all kinds of problems that had already been demonstrated under the high voltage transmission lines in Canada. So we heard all this and we, we realized that the house we had bought, hi, uh, the house we had bought in upstate New York was, uh, did not have a concrete basement. It was open to the earth, so it had a mud basement. So when people came to visit us from Pennsylvania, they said, well, we're so relaxed and we never get tired here. And we were putting them to work because we were redoing this old farmhouse. And so uh, we finally realized it was because we were getting Mother Earth energy 24-7. We were not blocked by concrete. So between learning about the ultra high voltage transmission line effects and the wonderful energizing effects of not living on concrete, I was so excited. We moved out to Pennsylvania. We were organic farming, but we lost that, ran out of money. So we came back to Pennsylvania, got some jobs. But meanwhile, in 1997, I discovered NECAN. And I realized that while we were up in upstate New York experimenting with natural living, um, Mr. Masuda was over in Japan discovering how to help protect us against all those distortions of our natural energy field. Now, all living things have always evolved in that natural uh, energy field. The Earth is a giant magnet, and there are different areas on the Earth that are higher magnetism, lower magnetism, and primitive peoples have discovered which ones, uh, which areas were more healing. The Indians, the uh, ancient Europeans, the Greeks, the Egyptians, they all knew the power of magnetic fields. 
And my daughter's a geologist, and I remember when she called me and said, you know, I'm learning in geology about the magnetic field of the Earth. So we're all, all living things do better in that natural energy field. And Nikon's products replicate that field. And it's really high tech. They've done an amazing amount of research, but it's, they've made it convenient. We just integrate the products into our lives and our bodies are in that micro environment of the good, healthy energy that, that we call it grounding or earthing. There's books out about it now, but uh, Nikan knew about it back in the 70s. So we will be doing some demonstrations with the magnetics. Um, I'm gonna go through a little PowerPoint here to um, give you a, a quick overview of Nikan. Here we go. So Nikan is about Discover Active Wellness, and that's why we call this world tour Active Wellness. We want to spread the message around the world that uh, we can take control, take active control of our wellness, and really try to stay more resistant to disease, more resistant to chronic problems that can develop over time. So it's an amazing approach, and uh, it, it's really about the little decisions we make every day. Are we choosing not to eat too much sugar? Are we choosing to drink quality water, to breathe quality air, to get enough sleep, to smile at our children, that kind of thing. When I left uh, law, I became a family counselor and uh, wrote a number of books on parenting. And I always had a good lifestyle section in there because I realized that a lot of the stress and irritability and sassiness by kids was just people were tired and frustrated from their day and didn't have a good way to renew themselves. So good sleep, good nutrition, good water, good air. And as you'll see, Nikan has addressed all those issues now. So the choices you make each day are what count. It's not big choices of, I'm gonna lose 30 pounds this month, or I'm gonna join a fitness club. A lot of those resolutions people made last month in January are already gone. Uh, it's the little decisions that we make. and on this, uh, this picture here, the humans being more, is the motto of the company and has been for 42 years. We're really building people and we use many mechanisms, including natural health, uh, natural products that restore us to natural health. If we don't make those little decisions, the negative effects add up and we become humans under stress, we don't achieve our potential. So it's the small choices that we make consistently over time that affect us in every way. Of course, the people that are suffering the worst, things are way worse even than 19 years ago when I started NECAN. Stress levels are higher because of financial stresses, before, because of more, more toxins in the environment, and uh, more, more toxins in our food, poorer nutrition because people are in a hurry, they're on a budget, they're working extra hours, and um, stress is associated with every chronic illness that kills us early and also all the ones that uh, reduce our quality of life. Heart disease, stroke, diabetes, cancer, and also fatigue, uh, depression, you know, where our mood altering medications are skyrocketing because people have so much anxiety and depression. There's fatigue, allergies, sleep problems, and of course the uh, obesity epidemic. As far as sleep, 70% of Americans say they've had sleep issues, and we know from science that one poor night's sleep drops your immunity by 30 to 60%. And I heard that in a lecture about sleep at the University of Pennsylvania. They said none of the medications actually get you into the deep sleep where your body restores itself, the nervous system, the immune system, the digestion. They do knock you out, so you, you get some rest, but they don't take you into the deep sleep. Only thing that can do that is Mother Earth. Uh, air and water are in the, the news every day because of pollution increasing. We now know that in most areas of the US, the uh, indoor air is worse than the outdoor air. And that's because we closed in our houses in the 70s to save on cooling and heating costs. And so any chemicals you bring in, 
that are out gushing from your carpets, from your curtains, even from your bedding, from your night clothes, um, you're breathing that and it concentrates more and more. Also, the positive ions that are not positive for your health accumulate because the house is closed up and that makes it harder for your lungs to get hold of the oxygen that it needs to balance the body. Also, um, the water is, you know, Flint, Michigan has caused a lot of people to notice that their water is polluted and the uh, cities, even Philadelphia says, well, our lead's too high too. And so they're starting to admit it. And uh, 260 contaminants have been found in tap water. Our tap water is treated, so it won't kill you right away. You're not gonna get some horrible infection. But over time, even the things they add to kill the bugs accumulate and uh, interact so that the chlorine, chlorinated compounds in your tap water are not good. And there's also lots of other chemicals that through, come through your tap that aren't going to kill you right away, just over time. Um, bottled water has been found to have thousands of contaminants, including endocrine disruptors. That's gotten a lot of attention recently. But there's also agricultural chemicals. There's also medications that have gone through other people's bodies upstream. So you really want to filter out all those big molecules and the heavy metals. And uh, so, so it's, it's really up to us at point of use to make sure that we're minimizing our toxic load. Now, I did a little video the other day about you, you, if you get dogmatic and crazy about it, your stress will go up. So you just do what you can do and, and smile <laughs> uh, as much as you can. Seven million premature yeah. deaths annually linked to our air pollution, according to the World Health Organization. Uh, it's huge. And... I have a woman in Philadelphia that's in, a, in an old apartment building, very cushy one, but it's old. And uh, she, she was breaking out all in her skin and wasn't sleeping well. And she bought a, a Nikon Air system. And she, every time I see her, she's like, that thing saved my life. You know, her, her skin is better. She can breathe. She sleeps deeper. Um, in, and this is... It helps is, with allergies, I love. Yeah, this uh, definitely, it makes a huge difference. Helps with allergies. Um, and uh, we don't make any medical claims. You know, we, we are just supporting the body to handle whatever's going on. And, of course, the people that suffer the most are the youngsters. Uh, many of us have parents or grandparents in their 90s, but we have to remember their first 20 years, they were eating organic. There was no such thing as GMOs. There was no such thing as agricultural chemicals. That's mostly since the Second World War. So even our generation may not last till 90 until they're really doing active wellness. And they're predicting that these children will not live as long as my generation, which is the baby boomers. Obesity rates are at their highest, 36%. Uh, last count, 78 million adults and 12 million children. That's, that's crazy. And a population of, of almost 300 million, that's, that's like at least a quarter. Um, one out of every five adolescents were obese in last count, and 30% of children are overweight. And we know it's because of too much consumption of empty calories, too much exposure to toxins, which mess up their energy system. So they're craving more food and uh, inadequate consumption of essential nutrients. And this is, we're seeing chronic disease in younger and younger people, which is unacceptable. Type 2 diabetes, they're saying that a third of the kids right now are going to be diabetic. It's, it's really frightening. Less than half of adolescents eat the needed amount of vegetables. Only 27.1% of high school children report having enough active physical activity. And that's understandable because they're not eating well, they're not sleeping well, and uh, a good third of them are obese. Low-income families obviously have it worse. They're often in food deserts. They're um, uh, exposed to aggressive advertising of poor quality foods. Of course, they have more stress and anxiety and depression and less access to, to um, preventive health care as well. So this is really scary for the younger generation. And uh, it's, it's not fair. What are we going to do?
The answer is humans being more, making active wellness choices. We call that the process through which people become aware and make choices based on their new awareness to have a more successful existence. You need to be healthy by choice, not by chance. I think I've made it clear that if you leave it to chance, you listen to the ads or just don't pay attention to your sleep or the quality, uh, what your toxic load is on your body, uh, it's the chances aren't good that you're going to have a healthy life for 100 years. So this is where Nikon comes into the picture. And uh, it took 20 years for them to even convince the founder that America was ready for Nikon because we were so wrapped up in chemical solutions to things. And uh, so, but um, because of my generation, thank goodness, we were interested in prevention and wellness and natural living. So um, in 1989, Nikon came here and then they reached, realized we were the richest sickest nation in the world so they moved their headquarters to North America and it's now a Canadian American corporation rather than Japanese but still very active in Japan uh, it's the only international company with a, a holistic comprehensive approach to preventive health and that's very exciting to me because that's where I started and from the beginning they had a philosophy of life in balance the five pillars of health, healthy mind, healthy body, healthy family, healthy society, and healthy finances. And my husband and I fell in love with that idea because we felt that when we left big firm law practice that we kind of sacrificed the whole financial possibilities. But uh, we wanted that to be around positive people. We wanted to have healthy bodies and the, the uh, Partners in my firm, they were all pasty, putting on big tummies, didn't speak to their kids because they never saw them. Half of them were divorced. You know, that was not a good path to follow. Uh, even though they made, you know, five, six figures, it, it, they, they weren't happy people. So I, I didn't think that was the model I wanted. Um, if, you're, if you're chasing the dollar and don't have time for your family, you don't feel good. If you don't have time and money to contribute to the causes you care about, you don't feel good. Um, so if any of those is out of whack, obviously if your health's falling apart, your career will fall apart, you can't be there for your kids, and you may even get a bad attitude. So you know, everything is affected uh, if anyone is weak. So it's a powerful philosophy. And it's not just a, like we're gonna be of service to humanity. This is Nikan's philosophy. And every decision they make is based on that. So how many corporations have that kind of message at the core of their being? They may speak it, but they don't really do it. Right. They speak it, but they don't do it. So the Nikon advantage with active wellness is that holistic approach to living. And Nikon started out with, with the magnetics, like I said, but then they evolved to have a organically based whole foods supplementation program and uh, a water system, which we're going to demonstrate a little later, and uh, a light that gives you uh, the solar spectrum indoors. I'm pointing to this, but this is not it. And, uh, and of course, the sleep. Uh, on the futon idea of uh, Japan, mattress toppers you can put on top of any uh, mattress and it puts you in that ideal earthing environment. So I'll give you a little more detail about it. Um, these are leading edge science-based products that replicate natural energy. So it's, they're not remedies, they're not treatment, they're, they're designed to support the whole body. And it, it's a really important concept to get because most of us, you know, we see all these drugs ad, all, drug ads all the time. Okay, if your tummy's bothering you, take this. If your eyes are bothering you, take that. If you have cramps, take this. It's about helping the body do what it needs to do. And uh, so all of our products are balanced. You're never going to overdo something. So the nutrition and skin care, since I, I became a certified nutritionist in 1980, I was excited to see what Nikon was doing in the nutrition area. And they're now in their fourth generation of nutrition. And some of the really top researchers in the world come to Nikon and ask Nikon to distribute their products. For instance, our osteodens, 
which are, is our bone health program, it, it is uh, derived from uh, milk of organically raised cows, and it is the immune factor in, in mother's milk that builds healthy bones in a newborn. And we have this in our body, but we're replenishing it as we age so that our bones tend to stay healthier. It's an amazing product that we just, I, my husband and I take everything they can mix, except the pet products. Uh, we also have a top uh, antioxidant drink, no added water, preservatives, coloring, um, no additives, but just exotic juices combined. Did I bring that? Yes. Uh, all these exotic uh, fruits that add up to supporting all the major um, core systems yeah, sure. of the body. Sure. And afterwards, you can come up and use my little magnifier to read the small print on these bottles. Uh, and then we have a full line of skin care, including hair care. And at first, I'm like, oh, hair care, that's sort of an external thing. But your hair, it, your, your follicles are right there. And whether they put on good hair or not is, is a sign of your total health. So Nikan went with a wonderful shampoo and conditioner, which those of us who have long hair, and there are a lot of them in the room, um, love it. Absolutely love it. And I know uh, I've heard from my hairdresser, a couple of other hairdressers, that they're using it with their clients now because it just makes the hair feel so good and the organic? scalp feels so good. As organic as possible. There's organic materials in it. Um, and then the environment. I've already mentioned that Nikon has a second to none water system. That's up here. That's the waterfall. And they call it waterfall because it does everything that a natural waterfall does. It aerates and it magnetizes and it alkalizes. It purifies first and you just put your tap water in the top, takes off out all the nasty stuff, puts back the good alkaline minerals from these special stones that come from the Asia and uh, then it puts it through a magnet and also gives it far infrared energy, which is the, the frequency of the sun that, that warms and relaxes tissue. Uh, we also have the light. I have one in my desk. I didn't bring it here. And the air system, which, which filters five different ways and creates the, the negative ions, which are the good ions that you get by a waterfall or by the ocean. And of course, the, my favorite category, the rest and relaxation category, because seven or eight, ideally nine hours, you spend in the environment of uh, the natural energy with the sleep system. And it's made in the US of completely sustainable natural material and uh, with little power buttons throughout the system. And uh, we, our vacation home, we just got a new one, and it's, it's awesome. And that's fourth generation of this. They're always enhancing their um, sleep pad. It's called a nature rest, which is a great name, because that's what it is, natural rest. And then there's a comforter that uh, gives you the far infrared and the magnetics and gives you the beneficial ions, because they have special uh, crystals in there that emit the good... Uh, negative ions and the pillow is ergonomically designed and also has all those same technologies and it also uh, has the same sustainable material. The two smaller products that you see on the screen are the insoles which is also in the fourth generation of um, quality enhancement. Not only gives you the magnetics when you walk around, it's feeding it up just like you're walking barefoot through the park and it gives you the uh, oh, thank you. The um, far infrared energy and the negative uh, ion energy. And same with the, the back, what we call the Kinko Flex, these little power buttons. And we'll do some demonstrations with this in a moment, too. And so it's truly an amazing line of products, and they're always coming out with new ones. Some of the newest ones are this uh, kinetic tape. And you've probably seen athletes, when you watch the Olympics, they had the tape on them. Nikon's is now black. They came out with blue just to get attention first off, but now it's black. But Nikon's kinetic tape also has the far infrared reflective technology and gives off the beneficial ions. 
it, it has to be flexible, so I couldn't put magnets in it. But it does everything else, and people have such great results for discomforts in the shoulder or the knee, any area that's stressed, this will help it relax and restore. And then this is uh, one of the, the newest technologies, absolutely amazing. It's pulsed magnetic field. And you put it anywhere that hurts for just a couple of minutes and it tends to relax it and restore it uh, to, to help reduce the inflammation, that kind of thing. That's a medical term, so I shouldn't use it. Um, <laughs> but it, it, it makes it feel better. It's truly amazing. And uh, somebody should come and sit on the chair because that's the best way to get all five technologies. Um, this is the Niken Kinko seat, and it's truly amazing. Does anybody have a back issue that they'd like to try this background? Neck issue. Neck issue. Okay, there's a couple of things for that. This is Johanna, everybody. So just put that around. Yeah. All right. So uh, let's see for the neck. This is called a power band. It also So how are you feeling before you put them on? Well, I put some uh, heat on last night and then morning I woke up. It was okay and then driving here it was bothering me right here. Okay. Okay, you want to try this. So let's see. What do you use that for? Anything that's hurt. I was sitting all day. Okay. Just do the pulse on your elbow. Yep, pulse on your elbow. So we have somebody on the seat, somebody using the power band on her neck and the um, neck flex with the kinkotherm belt around her waist. And Jamil's sitting on the seat. And uh, anywhere, anywhere where you're feeling stress or, or um, fatigue. At some point, can you explain the far infrared? Far infrared, yes. Um, How that, does that get in the water? Oh, yes. Um, they can develop uh, technology that um, ceramics, that actually NASA discovered that you could develop ceramics that uh, reflected different wavelengths of light and other electromagnetic spectrum things. So far infrared is just beyond red. We can't see it. But you know those uh, far infrared glasses that you see in the movies and the, the military uses it. So um, that's, that actually is a warming energy of the sun. If you go out on a cold day and feel the warmth on your cheek, the body is changing that far infrared to warmth. So that's what it is. And it tends to relax the tissues and uh, give them a natural warmth. So people that go to sleep with cold hands and feet, um, if they're under that comforter, that problem is gone. It's quite delightful. And so in there, in the filter, there are uh, special ceramic beads that reflect that energy. It's everywhere, but it, it puts it into the water. Does that make sense? Cool. Okay, so, so let's begin your new success story of active wellness and living a life in balance. If any of those five pillars are a little weak, whoever uh, invited you to come here can help you use Niken to bring things back into balance. And we define success as the progressive realization of a worthy ideal. So I'm going to end my, uh, my little introductory PowerPoint here. And I'm going to invite our very special guest. I'm excited to have Dr. Stanley Bogutz uh, be here. I've known him. We meet so many wonderful people in Nikan. That's one of the joys. It's a collaborative entrepreneurship with people around the country and around the world. And um, Dr. Stan it has been involved, uh, I think, even longer than I have. And he's had many, many benefits. Uh, from the products, so I want him to share his idea of what Nikan can mean to you. So, Stan, let's see, uh, you're you're unmuted, so I'm going to mute myself, and if I have questions, I will come back on. But okay, 
Okay. Well, thank you. Thank you for having me. That was an excellent presentation uh, with the PowerPoint. That was very uh, enlightening. One thing I'd like to point out, though, on the on the uh, the environmental things, uh, you know, is I think it's about ten years ago, um, a study came out with um, about two hundred and eighty five chemicals in um, in the umbilical cord of newborns. So you have uh, you, the people out there with with kids. Uh, you have to think about that because you got this little toddler running around on the floor. Uh, kicking up all that dust from the carpets and inhaling all the fumes from the chemicals and that kind of thing. So I think that's an imp interesting or important point to uh, point out when we're, when we're talking about the products is that uh, even little kids now are being uh, born with chemicals in their body. And, and you know, what does that do? They don't even have an immune system yet. So uh, that could, that could really devastate these kids. And, you know, we t talk about uh, all these problems that kids have now with uh, attention deficit and that kind of thing. But let me let me get out to my story and uh, keep you guys going. And uh, I'm a podiatrist. I've been in ECAN for uh, 24 years and uh, living every minute that I've done with it and use all the products just, just as Randy does. So only thing, I don't use the women's formula. Just right off the bat, I don't do that. But the cats used to drink the water and uh, and and uh, and the the uh, green zymes. But uh, but being a podiatrist, I was really uh, really had uh, very successful. I had three offices. I worked seven days a week, and um, saw people on Sunday morning after church or Saturday after Saturday morning before I started my weekend. Uh, because when you do surgery and that kind of thing, you have you you can't afford to take the time to dressing changes and that kind of thing. And when I was in practice, we didn't have the opportunity of having uh, PAs or nurse assistants and that kind of thing. I did a lot of work myself. So uh, you know, I, one of my offices was like uh, 57 miles one way from the opposite rural Pennsylvania. But I started getting sick and uh, tired and achy. I uh, might developed a lot of joint discomfort and uh, couldn't wave bye-bye with either hand. Couldn't do that. And uh, we started dropping instruments, hazard going numb, started to develop back problems, and became very fatigued. Every joint, every muscle, every bone in my body ached. And I felt every bump in the highway when I drove my car. When I went to bed, I couldn't, uh, I couldn't sleep. I mean, I would get up every half hour. I couldn't even turn over in bed. I would have to sit up and decide what side I was going to sleep on and then sleep on that side. And when I woke up in the morning, I have to prop myself up and then get going. Well, that's how it was. And then I said, whoa, what am I going to do? So I hired podiatrists. They were fortunate they uh, would come and help me with my practices. And they gave me one day a week from their office to keep the practice going while I try to get better. So I saw so, quacks. I did everything that you could probably think of. I saw 28 specialists over a period of two years period of time at a famous clinic not too far from where I live in Pennsylvania. And it's only a two hour drive to Cleveland. But anyway, uh, did that and uh, 28 specialists over a two year period of time. And my options were uh, to fuse my wrists to stop the pain, that, the discomfort that I was having in the wrist. And the other option was to um, uh, uh, release the nerves in my, in my, I could say carpal tunnel. Uh, the other option, if that didn't work, was to fuse my neck because I have some challenges with my spinal cord. But anyway, and if that didn't work, to learn to live with it. Well, of course, being a doctor, I know that uh, we don't make uh, guarantees and uh, that, well, I'm going to learn to live with it. So, sold the practices and didn't know what I was going to do. Um, I finally uh, was introduced to NECAN by a physician who thought I would be interested in, uh, in the products, especially the magnetic insole for, uh, for my patients because diabetics and that kind of thing could use a, or, you know, any kind of foot problem. But uh, you know, I wasn't interested in it. But the point is that I, but through a three-way conversation, his, he brought his, um, invited his uh, sponsor from Atlanta, Georgia, and we were talking, and she was telling me about the product experiences in Atlanta, Georgia. And I thought, well, you know, I'll. Um, she was coming from her heart. She was telling me 
you know, she's so sincere and so you could not help but believe her. And I became a distributor that night, not knowing what I was going to do. And I, it, you know, invested the money and bought the products that I thought I would need, or I went on what they suggested that I should do. So what happened was um, I drove home that night thinking about, yo, what did I do? But I got my products a couple of weeks later, and the first thing I got was a sleep system. Well, put the sleep system on my bed, and you know, I felt this tingling going through my whole body, and I thought, whoa, there's something going on here. And I fell asleep like a baby. I slept for, that night I slept for four solid hours. First time in 12 years I slept that long. I mean, I didn't get up. I didn't have to sit up and decide what side I was going to sleep on. But four hours, and I woke up because I had a headache. I did not use the pillow. I don't know why I didn't do it. it was, and then in those days, it was hard like a brick. But, but you know, I took a couple of time and I went back to bed and uh, slept like a baby until 7 o'clock in the morning. I, how I slept, how I hit that bed, that's how I slept. That's how I woke up. I didn't, I didn't have to turn around. I didn't have to do anything. And then I woke up in the morning and I, I literally jumped out of bed. I mean, I couldn't believe it. I just jumped out of bed. I could not even, I, I can't believe it. I mean, I just, I just, you know, that was it. I mean, I felt so great with that good night's sleep. So after that, I started using the products uh, for my wrists and my elbows and my knees. And one time, I think uh, Randy might have a, a, cop, a little, one of the, uh, our newer product anyway. Um, 55 uh, magnets I wore on my body, which included the max steps and the, the flex pad that, that's on display right now. But, you know, that gave me back my life. So what could he can do for you? It could really, if you're really, if you're really having challenges, you have to try it and, and, and see what it's going to do. It gave me back my life. I'm, uh, I sold my practice as I moved to Erie, and I'm now back in practice. Uh, I could wave bye-bye. I could do anything now that I want to. You know, yeah, but, and I'm, get, I'm getting a little older, so I do have challenges that the products help me out with uh, with uh, getting through life. It's, uh, it's been an amazing uh, journey for me, and uh, I shared the products with, uh, with several of my colleagues and several people, and at that time it was Warren, Pennsylvania, and just, just started to see the, a business develop. And uh, so uh, join us, whoever invited you there today. Uh, um, get more information and just become a product the user and see how, and share it with your friends and see what happens. It's a lot of fun. Join us. Good group. Thank you for listening. <laughs> Anything. Thanks, Dan. Yeah. It's, it's such a moving story. I mean, to have a podiatrist who can't practice anymore, and now you're practicing again. That's pretty awesome. Yeah. yeah. And and it's interesting, Nikan just started with those insoles. So a lot of podiatrists have discovered Nikan because it, it can lower the stress level of the, the uh, people's feet. Yeah. Well, yeah. I mean, what, you... You, uh, you can do the demonstration. I'm sure you're going to do that. But, uh, yes, yes. Uh, let me turn on the light. Maybe we can do that. Let's see. Who isn't wearing insoles? <laughs> Somebody here is not wearing insoles? You're not? Oh. I don't have insoles. Do you have other? other uh, oh, you have such pretty shoes. You didn't put them in there. Okay. <laughs> So let's see. You can take off that necklace. Hey, hey, hey Randy. You know, let me let, let me point something out on, on insoles. You know, people say, "Oh, I could get them from Walmart, or you know, twenty nine bucks or something." I, I've done demonstrations with people uh, wearing the uh, uh, other product. That's not our technology. And actually, when you do the strength test, you'll actually draw. The strength out of them while they oh i mean i have a bu bunch of them wrong yeah, i almost brought some today but i thought oh there's enough to demonstrate but yeah. i i didn't know that it would drop i've seen it just not do anything yeah yeah but you actually you'll see the it'll it, it'll just it'll just zap them of the energy wow yeah. okay well um have michelle here and let's see if we can the necklace, does that interfere with the neck, neck? It's well, a magnetic necklace? It's, it's a Nikon necklace. It doesn't, it's a Nikon necklace, so it would have helped her. 
Uh, okay, so um, let you put your hands out like this. Yeah, but she, she might have a problem if she's wearing a magnet problem now. Yeah, she did take it off, but it's she's been benefiting all day. So, you know, we'll see if it's how, how dramatic it can be. Okay, you ready? Mm -hmm. I'm going to press down and you resist. This is a kinesiology demonstration. One, two, three, resist. Yeah, she, she's really strong. She's been having that around your shoulders. But let's try the insoles anyhow and see what it does. Okay, I'll do it again. Ready? One, two, three, resist. I love this. Oh my goodness. So, you know, you're going to get I'm another used. pair and cut them to fit those pretty shoes. <laughs> and let's do a balance too. I was using just, so much less pressure this yeah, time. Yeah, exactly. And I was pushing as hard as I could. So, we're going to do a balance here. Okay. So, I'm going to press up this time. Okay. And they won't let you fall. Okay. One, two, three, resist. Oh, resist? Mm hmm. Okay. Okay. <laughs> All right. Step back. Okay, we'll do that. The balance. Okay. So I get my exercise ready. Okay. Okay. Oh, wow. <laughs> Anybody else want to try? You want to try? Oh, he's a tennis player and he uses a lot of the products, but he's not wearing insoles today, which is silly. <laughs> well, I, but he I was, have the old insoles. I have the you original, were sleeping the on the pattern ones. Yeah, okay. I have them. I'm, yeah, I'm, well, I'm you need the new ones because you get the far infrared and the ionic. Um, then you did, you did sleep on the sleep system. Yeah. So we'll see. Um, you're a guy, you might be pretty strong. So let's just use one arm, which is your that's your tennis arm, right? Yeah. Let's use your other arm. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's a tennis teacher too. Okay, ready? One, two, three. Resist. Okay, I'm pressing as hard as I can. Okay, step back. Okay, do it again. Let's do it again. Ready? One, two, three, assist. Oh, yeah. <laughs> do it one more time. Do that one more time. <laughs> but I'm going to push on it. <laughs> so get on now, here again. Let me do that one more time now with this. Yeah. Now we're going to sit there. All right. One more Ready? time. One, two, three, resist. <laughs> so, I'm so much stronger. I can swing there. Yeah. I'm still, wow. That's a, that's amazing. All right, you gonna start wearing these more often? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Good. I All have right. the one pattern one with the you know cover on it. Oh yeah. Padded. Okay. I have the original ones. Yeah. Yeah. So, those are those are they're, they're still magnetic. magnetic. All our products are magnetic forever, uh, one million years. But the the new technologies are always a little better. So it's good to update. It's just like a cell phone. Every three or four years, you like update. What's that? Well, because that starts because being treatment not, oriented. We're not, not treatment. Feet. Yeah, we're not treatment oriented. You get your own orthotics. We just support the body naturally because that you know that's a specific problem, so you get specific answer to it. But we're all about whatever will support the body doing its own natural thing. So that that's a good question. I got to it make is, that it's, point. It's, it's <laughs> that. Yeah. <laughs> He has an answer because he's a podiatrist. Well, he could he could wear the uh, the orthotics with the device and with the magnetic insoles. Surely. So he's saying, you know, you just wear it, them with your orthotics. So put the uh, knee can, uh, the insoles under and then put the orthotic on, on top. On top. Of the put the orthotic on top of the oh. magnetics. Because no. it's shaped for your foot. Well, you could you could you could try it the other way, but I I've, I've been playing around with mine and the newer ones. It, it doesn't bend um, to shape the orthotic, um, but you still get. Uh, so if you put it, if they put the insole on top of the orthotic, you're liable to pop the magnetic out. That the oh right, the little so magnetic that, buttons. Okay. Yeah. But, you, but because of the because of the 360 degree rotation of the of the magnet. You could you could still get the effect with your orthotic on top. Good, yeah. good point. All right, thank you, Stan. Now, um, Johanna, you've been using some of the products. So, what are you noticing with your neck? She's had bit. she's had the okay, so cool. I took it off a little bit to see if the pain would return. Uh huh. Try it. Yeah, a little, a little better. Cool, good. She said. Like Mm -hmm. and, um, yeah, it's very interesting. Some people perceive heat if, if there's not enough uh, warmth coming to the area. Some people feel cooling if, if there's inflammation and heat. So it's really um, what your body needs, which is what's so cool about Niken. It doesn't, uh, it responds to the body. And how, how about your back, Johanna? Um, that's not feeling any 
any different. It really wasn't bothering me too much today, but I thought maybe I could feel a little better. So yeah. Anything. Well, we do have a, a pain, okay, know? we do have a demonstration with that. Can, Jamil, can you volunteer for that since she's been wearing it for quite a while? Can I use your, uh, I'll need to demonstrate this. Let me pick this up. Okay. Yeah. So you're not wearing any magnets presently? Okay. So what I want you to do is um, bend down and touch your toes. Okay, you're pretty flexible. And um, let's see, put, put your arm out and turn to the back and turn, leave your feet flat and turn as far as you can to the back and mark the wall as far as you can turn comfortably. Ah, see, you're very flexible. Well, I've been wearing the back brace. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, and you, he's been sitting on the seat, too, actually. He's been sitting on the seat. I forgot about that. Well, let's see if we can make it even better by having it right on there. Let's see. How do you do? There you go. All right. So um, why don't you touch your toes again, see how it feels. Is that a little easier? About the same. And put your arm out and see how far you can go. Yeah, it's a little farther. Yeah. Okay. Cool. So that's real comfortable. Feels good. Yeah. 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 So you've been wearing it, so you know. Right. Right. Okay. Cool. So uh, now you're you have a, you're a very busy guy too. Um, you're sort of part of that gig economy. We're going to talk a little bit about later. Uh, where you you've got a couple of different sources of income, right? You you yeah, have a barber yeah. shop and, and yeah. you also do some driving, right? Uh, well, I I got a janitorial company. Oh right, okay. Yeah, and I just uh, bought a truck, so now I'm going. You know, Whoa, to okay. Yeah. So can you see how maybe sharing Nikon with people would be a third source? Exactly. exactly. <laughs> That's my fourth. Good. Yeah, I, yeah. I got some entrepreneurial spirit there. Yeah. Excellent. So um, let's see. I guess uh, let's do a water demonstration. Um, do you want to handle that, Michelle? Okay. Can you do that? Because you set it up kindly. And uh, Jamil, do you have a water system? I have a water system. Mine was already assembled halfway, I guess, when, when I got it. But in order for me to get the water out, I got to press this way. Oh, funny. Yeah, so I got. Oh. I, I just noticed when uh, the gentleman oh. here took a glass of water, he just pushed it in, which I thought that was that's a natural, natural yeah. you know, way it's supposed to be. But mine came out, so I got to, I guess, oh, that's but I was still funny. able to get to and I don't have these big rocks. I just got, like, What? Little, Why didn't you get the rocks? Well, the rocks, I thought it came, came with it. Yeah, it's a got, box of rocks. Yeah, my, 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 they're like little, I don't know, like, you know, they're a lot smaller. Is it a Nikon one? Must so, not be yeah. Nikon. Yeah, I got it from Nikon. That's weird. We'll have to investigate. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> yes, yeah, same, same, I've never heard same. Of that. Yeah, That's but so I don't true. have, I don't have the rocks and my, uh, the lever comes out. That's strange. Okay, well, we don't. Yeah, that's where the opportunity comes from. And it gets into the, and everything we do in modern life uh, acidifies our body. Stress does it, medications does do it, pain does it, steroids do it, uh, overperformance creates acids, and poor diet. Uh, you know, sugar, uh, fried fats, they all acidify the body. So it doesn't hurt to have water at the natural level that you would get from a mountain stream that's bubbling up among limestone. And, uh, and so to, to let him know, the box of rocks comes under the base in the box when it shifts. Oh, okay. So there's a there's box of rocks, she, she says, is under the base of the box. So make sure you didn't find the box, the rocks. I mean, make sure that you didn't get the rocks and you just didn't see them. Because sometimes they, they, this is Asian packing. They pack things beautifully. I was in Japan when I was 10 years old, and they showed me how they their packaging is amazing. So sometimes you don't find stuff until you search. So. Yes, very, very efficient. Efficient, but not necessarily obvious. Yeah, right. You might, you might miss seeing something. 
So, um, Johanna, would you like to try the water? Yes. Would you be willing to try it? Okay. So. So this, this I just poured this on. Um, we can mix wines. Let's see if you have, you have a multi here. A wine? Yeah. Well, so. you know, we filled it with rain water. Uh -huh. This mm -hmm. one is rain. Oh, new one? The new multi? Yeah. So that's yeah, for men so, or women? Yeah. yeah. Okay. All right. So Johanna is tasting the water. And uh, wait a minute. What we're going to do okay. demo. What, uh, the say. easiest thing is just to, to put them thumb and fourth finger. Mm -hmm. So put them together, mm -hmm. and she's going to try to spread them. Okay. Yeah. we got to mute you, Madeline. Madeline, mute yourself, please, because you're on the screen. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Madeline? Yeah. I'm, I'm unmuted. I mean, I was muted. Oh. Not me. Okay, let me see what's going on here. Same thing. Ah, I and, I'm using, and I'm using my pinkies. How can that be? That's <laughs> okay. First. There we go. It's working now. Amazing. You saw that? Yeah, so which water would you prefer to drink on a regular basis? <laughs> Good. Yes, alkalized, filtered, and energized. It's, it's truly amazing. Um, so that's the water. We have checked the magnetics and um, the nutritionals. I'm going to carve up some of the paleo bars. There's only four ingredients. They're all organic. If you were born a thousand years ago, you would still have these foods. So our bodies know how to deal with them. So this is our um, certified organic, vegan, no GMO, 100% raw, no preservatives, gluten-free, no added sugar, and it's a chocolate nut with almonds and uh, dates. And it's delicious. When we drove up to our vacation place uh, and back, that's what we had on the road. And then we also have the Tropical Delight, which is almonds and coconut and pineapple and dates. Tastes fantastic. So I will carve them up so people can try them. And uh, let's see. Um, I want to mention just a couple other things before I stop the recording. And that would be um, if anybody's interested in, let's see in building the business and I'll go into this in more detail if there's interest but I just want to show a couple of slides here let's see hmm, where is it Well, it's not opening. Right there. there it is. Okay. So are you all seeing this? No, it's not screen sharing. No. You're seeing it? No? No. No. Hmm. If you can't get it, Randy, we can see the screen behind you. That's okay if you can see. Okay, let's see. So you still don't see it? That's weird. So, so you can screen you can see the screen behind me, you said. Yeah. Not as well as seeing screen sharing, but that's okay. Proceed. <laughs> okay, well, I'll be talking anyhow. Uh, whoops, when did that happen? All right. So anyhow, um, this is a, a unique choice to 
help handle the other parts of the five pillars of health. And I'll just go through these really quickly, just as an introduction. So again, it's based on the five pillars, and this time it's the financial, society, family part. And of course, all the stress we were talking about earlier, um, obesity, toxins from young people smoking, which is horrible, um, stress over work and um, school, lack of money, healthcare costs going up all the time. A lot of us are sandwich generation. We have kids getting health care, uh, parents getting health care, grandparents that we're trying to take care of, um, debt building, cost of living is going up, and loss of employment. I just read a book about how a lot of these jobs are not coming back. It has nothing to do with immigrants. It's about automation and software. Corporations, they may bring a thousand jobs back, but the year before they let go of 17,000 because they put uh, in new software, or they don't have to communicate so much, or they they streamline. They've got robots in the on the, the manufacturing floor. Education expenses. I mean, there's been some talk of of trying to help college students, but it hasn't happened yet, um, and it keeps going up. Retirement savings. A lot of people can't afford to retire. There's just the money's not there. Uh, the numbers are frightening of what a typical 60-year-old has put aside. It's, it's negligible. And, of course, taxes aren't going away. Um, a new trend is emerging. We call it the gig economy. And this is uh, about helping each other. There's a, a lot of actual barter going on, but also small business break coming up. Um, entrepreneurial people are doing things online um, selling their own products or selling other products uber is a perfect example and and that's hard on the taxi companies uh, but it's it's sort of this uh, entrepreneurial thing that's going on and, and Airbnb that's replacing hotels and the hotels are hurting uh, we have a place in Monterey and the hotels are like everybody's staying in somebody's home um, it's it's changing everything and because of the digital world people can find each other to make these ex exchanges so there's new things coming up all the time that make it more and more possible to have these kind of gig uh, uh, connections so it's it's freelance work you know you can you can uh, hire somebody to mentor you doing digital or you can just go on one of those uh, websites where people will do it for $5 and they, they bid to help you with whatever you're trying to do. So that's freelance. And uh, it's a really, it's a new economy. And they say that within uh, five or 10 years, 40% of people are going to be involved in some kind of gig income. So that, that's a big change that nobody's really acknowledging because we still think in terms of corporations and jobs and salaries and uh, work by the hour. But the, the attraction of, of a gig economy where you're your own entrepreneur is increased mobility. Uh, and I was just talking to my daughter. She's been working at this company for 12 years as a, as a hydrogeologist. And she said, I want to be my own boss. I'm going to do something different. Um, millennials are joining the workforce, so there's more people coming in. Um, your business can be much more cost efficient if you're just working from home with your laptop. And uh, work-life balance is more in your control. And you can get extra income and... Uh, can really focus more on the kind of work you want to do. So what we love about Niken is that it easily integrates into your life. I mean, you just talk about the way you live. Okay, I got out of a sleep system. I'm wearing insoles. I've got the, this is a new, new, newest Niken jewelry. And for uh, February, for Valentine's Day, um, her necklace and my necklace and the power band and the bracelet, uh, power band bracelet are all <laughs> hint hint to husbands right um <laughs> the, the there uh, we have a minimum shipping fee with Nikon of ten dollars but for february the jewelry is a penny shipping which is a special special deal so that's to uh, 
to get um, joy for your honey. And, and the, the women can get the next thing for the guys. And a lot of guys wear the chain as well. They just call it a chain instead of a necklace. So um, <laughs> it makes a huge difference. Um, so we call it collaborative entrepreneurship where you help each other. People um, that aren't making any direct money from each other, we're, we're in a big mission to advance wellness technology and wellness, active wellness around the world. And it really is a turnkey operation, especially 19 years ago, Nikon wasn't online. Now you can put it on Facebook, you can send it around the world, you can have uh, customers in any of the 20 countries where Nikon does business. So what we do as Nikon entrepreneurs is we're utilizing the gig economy to offer people opportunity and income. We teach others to turn purpose into profits and uh, just find, find customers. And that's not hard to do now. Uh, a year ago, they lowered all the prices so that people wouldn't feel like, oh, I should pretend I'm a consultant and get lower prices. They lowered all the prices so that the, the customer prices, the retail prices, you just buy like from Amazon or anywhere else and you get great competitive prices. Although we don't have any competition because everything's patented, but even if it looks the same, it will be different and uh, it'll be comparable price. And uh, we love the idea that you're belonging to a like-minded community. Sometimes you can feel pretty lonely if you're really focusing on preventive health and natural living. And I've been there at times, um, but in Nikan, you have a community of people who want to help people who are interested in health and interested in personal growth. So that's really, really a benefit that, a lot of people don't expect when they join Niken. So this is a, a cute little diagram. When you join Niken, you get your product, and then if you want to share it with, with loved ones, you can make a little extra money, um, or you can invite people to an event like this and start really earning income. Niken does all the accounting, all the shipping, um, they send you a tax form for at the end of the year for any commissions that you've gotten. And uh, you have no need to inventory. Everything's drop shipped very quickly from the, the warehouses in California. And uh, Nikon has some wonderful, a really wonderful comp plan, compensation plan, pay plan, which they've simplified dramatically. And uh, so you get a great retail profit if you sell to customers. And then if you recruit a sales force, you get a bit of everything they do. And if you move fast, you can win cruises and cash and cool stuff like that. So my goal was to get to Japan next year by helping um, four people get to the silver level, which is not hard to do. It's a lot easier than it used to be uh, because they don't want any barriers to keep people from getting to the point where they're getting a nice little gig income. So um, collaborating with a purpose-driven community is a lot of fun. I'll explain that diagram if anybody's interested. So uh, those are all the different ways you can make money and some amazing incentives this year that I talked about going to Japan would be this last one. There we go. So um, let me get out of this again. And uh, let's see, get off of that. All right, so I'm not sharing the screen anymore, right guys? <laughs> okay, so um, I think if we have any quick questions, I can answer them right now and then I'm gonna end the recording and, and have you taste some of the goodies around here and uh, talk more of anything you might be interested in pursuing further. So Stan, do you have any, any final thoughts? I'm so happy you were able to join us. If you unmute yourself, and just share, uh, you know, your introductory or your recommendations. Well, my recommendations really are, are for those folks that, uh, that are um, in your audience there and those that uh, might be guests on uh, Zoom is to follow through on it, to try the products and uh, look into the gig economy and, and um, just do it, I guess. And don't uh, think about it. Just uh, Let's do it. 
Well, thanks for having me. I really appreciate it. This was a lot of fun. I was just thinking of how I'm going to send out a blanket email telling everybody this afternoon about our call tomorrow. And you all know that it's the same time, 8:30. But uh, but I do have to. I do have some errands I got to get done this afternoon. But I, this was a lot of fun. Thanks for inviting me. As does anybody in the audience have any questions for me? Randy, your group. Anybody here want to ask Dr. Stan a question? Uh, I have a question. Yes, Joanne. So is Dr. Is Dr. Stan, is that his name? His last name is Bogutz, but I call him Dr. Stan, his first name. Oh, Dr. Stan. So are you still you're practicing in your podiatry profession? Yes, I, yes, uh-huh. So then is it also, is it, how do you not have a conflict of interest if you're also selling Mecon products to your patients? I'm a therapist and if I were to like wear this and a client would ask me about it, I would wonder if I'd have a conflict of interest. It just oh, that's a good question for health professionals, yeah. It is a good question. And when I, when I present it to a patient, I don't present it to them as a treatment. I present it to them, I, I just tell them I'm taking off my doctor's hat and I have something that's, that's non-medical that could help them if they're willing to try it, and, um, and usually that's it. Uh, actually, I don't have a problem uh, with, uh, with the insoles. There are studies out that the insoles help uh, um, um, diabetic neuropathy. But I don't usually tell a patient that I'm treating the diabetic neuropathy. I just tell them I have a product that might, you know, they can go to a drugstore and buy it, but the point is I, we have better technology. Okay. And, and that's it. And then, and then I don't put that into my office uh, bank account. I have a separate bank account for that. So you have different accounting for the Nikon products and your practice. Yeah, yeah. So it's a it's a gig. <laughs> it's a, yeah, well, it's yeah. A gig. I'm just I'm, you know I I, I tell them it's a lot of people. I'll just say that there is a business associated with this. If you're interested, we can meet at a later date, not during office hours. So I try to separate it that way, and uh, a lot of physicians do that, and they don't seem to have a problem. I don't. I never heard of anybody going to jail. Or being <laughs> well, always, uh, we're always. I'm a clinical social worker, so we're always on talking about ethics, and you know, and even with the skyping now and teletherapy, you know, tele mental health, mm. and it's all about ethics, and we'd like to help more people, but we're worried about the licensing board criticizing this because they're not up to date with technology all the time. That's true. Well, it, you know, in Ohio, for example, you're not, you're not supposed to, I think, I can't remember if the law changed. I did have a license for Ohio, but excuse me, you were able to, you weren't able to join a network marketing company. That's what I, I recall. Huh. Uh, he said that he thought that there was a rule in Ohio that you, you couldn't be in a network marketing program. Physicians, yeah. Physicians, MD. Yeah, correct. I'm not sure. No. Andy yeah. is not in Ohio. So. No, he's not in Ohio, so he's okay. So uh, yeah, that that great answer, and and that makes all we have a lot of doctors and therapists and uh, uh, other health professionals in the can that figure out a way that they're, they're comfortable and and if you're treating it as separate and i love what he said of just uh, take off my doctor's hat it's like saying you know drink enough water i mean you can say that <laughs> yeah yeah i probably do so uh well thank you any other questions yes um dr stan do you have uh anyone that's used any of the Nikon technologies that didn't require surgery well, oh um, well, we we really can't talk about whether we're preventing medical intervention. I'm just talking about if someone was on the cusp of one treatment and the product assisted them so they were no longer at that risk. What was the, I can't. Uh, I oh, she's she's asking if if uh, if you know of stories where someone was uh, on the precipice for having surgery and because of the products they didn't need to. And I think that gets a little too close to medical. Yeah, 
Yeah, send me an email, I'll answer it. <laughs> yeah, there you go. <laughs> okay, well, on that note, uh, this is all about supporting the body's ability to heal itself and stay healthy in balance. So um, thank you so much, Dr. Stan. You know you have oh, to go. Yeah, my pleasure. And, uh, Dr. Stan Bogitz, it's been a pleasure. And all you people that are listening from afar, I'm going to stop the uh, recording now. So thank you and everybody who's here. Uh, I will, um, this will be recorded and I will post it on my YouTube channel.